Welcome back to another Backpage Gaming video today, we're reviewing another Prime Icon, I used him for about 21 games, a little bit of champs, a little bit of rivals, it's Robin Van Persie, Jack is going to be asking me some questions, I'm going to see what he's like, I'm going to get to the end card, see what I gave him out of 10, see what sort of value I think he's coming in at, Jack, take it away. Yeah Robbie, so quick plug down below. Some of you guys will have seen some Van Persie gameplay already because we are streaming over on twitch.tv forward slash Backpage Gaming. The link will be down below, like I said. But Rob, enough about that. Yeah. On to Van Persie. It's an absolute icon for the pair of us. An amazing Arsenal striker over the years. Yeah. You know, he, he scored a lot of goals for you. You know, drew some really good performances out of your team. And then for yeah. United, he did a few things. You know, he scored a couple of goals. But Rob, was he as good in game as he was in real life that is the question not quite jack i think it's the case for a lot of icons these days obviously people yeah. remember them so fondly but they don't really relate to fifa um, yes. i think he's There's just a victim of that really i think a lot of a lot of the dutch a lot of the strikers did, like you know, a lot of the slower yeah. strikers i was thinking specifically van basten the you know the 29 yeah. year old retiree that won here he won a ballon d'or too but yeah i think like you say rob van persie's he suffers from something yeah. It's a lack of balance. It's a, it's a terrible disease to have on FIFA. Yeah, he's not quite Thanos, is he? He's not perfectly balanced, as no. all things should be. No, he's, um, he's lopsided. Yeah, he is lopsided. He's one of the first players that I've used with bad balance that actually falls over. You know, players like Ibra and stuff have got bad balance, but they, they're they fine Ronaldo, with it. you know, they've got yeah. something about them. Haven't they? They've got that yeah. cheese. Yeah, but uh, Remy Van Persie, he just seems to trip, fall over on defenders and stuff sometimes, which is very annoying when yeah. you're trying to get to make a run or whatever, and then you're sort of isolated with your other striker. Um, it's just... His dribbling in general, his stats are very good, other than the balance, but yeah. very bad in-game. <laughs> Whether it's his body type, which it doesn't actually say. Uh, no, I think. Been... It feels like an average, sort of high and average, something like that. Um, doesn't feel good, I'll say that. He is very slow to turn, clunky, however you want to describe him. He is not a smooth criminal, as, a, as they say. Oh, it's it's not a great start for Robin. It's not no. so. Like you say, Rob, I think some icons just just don't feel great. They just you know they're not keeping up with the times. And I think yeah. you look at this Van Persie. I mean, we're you'll be seeing this tomorrow probably, guys. But Icardi's just come out for two hundred and twenty k um, from scratch. Yeah, you'd probably argue that that Icardi's a much better. He's got five more pace. You know, I know his shoot, his passing's not as good, but who cares? Um, you know, yeah. I think icons like Van Persie, they need some sort of overhaul that makes them feel worthwhile. Um, but on to, you know, some more of the positives, Rob. How yeah. does he feel in terms of shooting? Because he is a striker, he's a poacher. Yeah. Do you think he might get on better if you kind of play more of a, perhaps a possession game, you know, where you, you, you hold the ball a lot and then you pass yeah. it to your strikers just to score. You know, they don't have to do anything else, really. Yeah, I think he would do better in that role. I mean, he's shooting... Yeah. First few games have sort of hit and miss, but once you get used to it, like how he shoots and whatnot, he is very good. Um, I'm sure you saw the goal I scored I did. with him in the stream last night. Absolute banger. Um, but yeah, it's. I don't think the shooting is worth missing out on the dribbling and the pace that you get with other strikers yeah. for that price, if yeah. that makes sense. Like, I'd I rather have like 85 shooting or something. Yeah, well, Mbappe I mean, Mbappe is cheaper than him. Mbappé yeah, that's has 12 it, yeah. more pace and his shooting is insane anyway I'm sure if you've used Mbappé yes. you know how crazy his shooting bad, is he's not bad is he no, old, yeah. uh, old Killian he's, he's not yeah. a bad striker um, yeah. and I think that's kind of the, you know it's often the theme of these icon reviews in that they're not bad players sometimes but you know the, the cost of what they come at is crazy so yeah. in terms of you know speaking of pace Rob like you've just said he's not got quite as much as Mbappé but He's still got a very respectable 85 on looking at, on his face card. Yeah. How does it feel in game? Does it feel like 85 or does it feel a little bit slow, you know, because of the dribbling not being so great or uh it doesn't feel bad, I'll be honest. Um okay. I don't I think 85 is sort of on the bounds. I of... think that's you that's right where you, the cut off is yeah. for me personally. 84 and you're a little like mm, it looks yeah. ugly, doesn't it? Yeah, but 85 I think it's just about there. Obviously the same pace as Del Piero's mid which were reviewed. Same pace as Cantona, and for me personally, yeah. I think Cantona's feeling a little slow. I know what you mean. It depends on how you sort of use him, but once he is yeah. in behind, which don't get wrong was hard to do, he didn't really get caught up that much, but yeah. ideally you do want faster players. Um, 
I think his baby's faster than he's got. Ba- 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 yeah, his baby's two got two more pace. pace. Um, I don't. I'm not used the baby, but he has got slightly better agility and balance as well. So maybe that one does feel a little mm. bit better. But the pace. I can't imagine there's a huge yeah. difference between the two. You know what I mean? Yeah, the pace isn't as much of a negative as his dribbling is for me personally. Okay. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you do manage to get him behind him, he's going to be fast enough, and he's sort of got a little bit of strength to hold him off as well. But if you want someone blistering fast, yeah, avoid. Was, yeah. Was there anything that you? What was your favourite thing about the card, Rob? Was there something that Ooh. really kind of set him apart from from anyone, or was it just kind of uh, disappointment? Not really. No, I suppose seeing him in an Arsenal shirt again was nice. Um, yeah. Even though he did snake us, but you know. Uh, yeah, his shooting is really good. Don't get me wrong. It is. I don't know if it's the best yeah. I've used, but it is genuine. It's up there. It's up there. Like that yeah. goal I scored yesterday comes no, to mind. Yeah. But it's it's not worth losing out. Like it's not going to win you any more games than if you had Mbappe no. up front, for example. When you say Mbappe yeah. would win you more games than, you know, do you think he would have been the yeah. difference maker? Yeah, one hundred percent. Mbappe quite a lot recently. I used so. him up front with Mbappe. To be fair, okay. and Mbappe well, outshot doing. him definitely. Well, it's it's tough you know it, yeah. it hurts when we do a review and the player's not that great because yeah. we want Especially to be happy we want to be excited okay. yeah yeah. <laughs> yeah that's also very true I'd be interested to see you know if his prime moments has got a big balance boost or something. Yeah. that's usually what the moments do they usually go a bit crazy yeah. in terms of you know making sure that they're a bit more usable or making them you know a bit different so yeah. hopefully we'll see a big balance boost or something crazy because like you say Rob I think that and I mean maybe it's just his body type sometimes some players just there's no redeeming them, um, really. Yeah. It's you know it sounds quite dramatic, but do you think Rob he'd be a, maybe a little bit better at cam? You know, with being a bit slower. Or uh, I tried that... a bit of cam as well. I think yeah, he yeah. could honestly do the job there. But personally, I mean, it depends on your preference. If you yeah. want someone him like him to play at cam with a long range shooting, like the, his passing is genuinely really good as well. Don't get me wrong, I didn't yeah. really touch on it, but his passing is good. Um, but personally, I prefer like a little nippy person like Neymar or something like that. Cam, yeah. I don't know how you feel, but I think... Yeah, no, I'd agree with yeah. that. I think for me, being able to have good left stick dribbling is... Yeah. Not, not like Maybe not a necessity, it's a bit dramatic, but... It's a definite it's advantage. It's very handy to have. Yeah. yeah. I think you do miss it quite a bit when you've not had it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, it, it's an annoying card to use. He's also only got yeah. 7 times stamina. I mean, I know it's not like... That was a big negative as well. He got... Yeah. Tired, tired, like yeah. Not ideal. Not the greatest. No. So Rob, I mean I we're not gonna we're not we'll not hang about. We'll get to the end card, Rob. What yeah. did you give him out of ten? I'm in tr- I'm I'm th- I'm gonna guess like seven and a half. I gave him a six point five out of ten. Wow. Yeah. Fair. Not yeah. good. Uh yeah. just not fun to use really. It was just I felt like I had to force myself to use it if that Try makes and sense enjoy yeah, yeah exactly it's really tough when you're doing a review and the play is just like not yeah not agreeing with you yeah definitely don't get me wrong i'm not saying if you use him if you want to pick him up and you enjoy him yeah. like people just have different opinions on cards sometimes whether yeah. you're more suited to a card like that don't get me wrong let us know in the comments if you if you've used him and you like him but yeah, yeah uh value for coins it's a two he's 800k 700k and he is not good yeah i mean nice. Yeah. You could argue that the two is just because he's got icon links. I he's imagine. an icon. It's Van Persie. If you're a big Van Persie fan, you want an icon. Yeah, I mean, only reason but, it yeah. is a two, really, even if it's yeah. that high. Jeez. Uh, <laughs> yeah. He's Ken not Style. back, is he, our Rob? No, I'm not. This is, I think that's my first negative review. Yeah. Um, so I've got a lot of pent up aggression, I feel like, yeah. playing champs. <laughs> uh, especially especially with this geezer. Yeah. Um, he's making it worse. Isn't yeah. It? In terms of Ken Style, it's got to be an engine. If you're using anything yeah. else. Yeah, you're going to struggle big time, I think. Because like, I've always said the engine makes players feel better as well, so God knows what it feels like without that. <laughs> um, in terms of links, he's Dutch. There are a lot of nice links. One that I did yeah. think of was that Tahith Chong. Uh, he's still yeah. available. I like Chong. Uh, yeah, and that's a, a good, strong link did for him. a player him. review on him, actually. We did, yeah. Out. Yeah, go check it out. Uh, another also one as well. Teze, the boy. There's Teze as well, yeah. And then I've also gone for the uh, Grudevelt, Danjuma. Oh yes, Rudevan. Well. Yeah, yeah. I th- think for me, to, like as a, you know, if you got like Van Persie in an eye compact, that's yeah. the only potential link. Yeah, Teze Awusu as well is a good right back. Yeah, very solid from the milestones. But yeah, he has got a good, lot of good links. If you're looking for a Dutch icon, you can afford Cruyff. Go for yeah. Cruyff. 
Uh, I've not used the likes of Van Basten or anything like that. Maybe I'll give him I a go. Imagine See how he compares, two, but yeah. The two just sit more really. You look at Van Basten and, you know, his. I mean, it, it is slightly better. It's somewhat better. I mean, he's actually got an okay card, Van Basten, but the three star eh, yeah. makes him a bit ugly. But 83 pace as well. Yeah. It's not the greatest, but. Yeah. It's those type of cars that are just they don't get the respect on FIFA that they deserve. Do Absolutely they? not. No, they just they just don't translate well to to FIFA gameplay to the the fast you know twitchy nature of it. Exactly. Um, yeah. Is that about it, Rob? Is that everything? I think that's about it, mate. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, yeah. ladies and gents, that's been Rob's first negative review. I'm not always this negative, guys. This is your first video. Usually, I'm a I'm a positive guy. I'm not usually like this, but yeah. You have to check Sometimes out you've reviews. got to be, aren't you? You have you've to be. To I'm be. not. Yeah, I can't. We're saving you guys from exactly. Spending your hard yeah, I can't hype him up, and then one of you guys picks him up and hates him. I'll be the yeah. I'll be suffered with a, a lot of abuse. I think. Exactly. Yeah. There you go. But like like Rob said, if you have enjoyed the video somehow, yeah. you know, leave a like down below. Make sure to subscribe. Check us out on Twitch. We're going to be streaming every few, you know, every few days. We're not going to try. It. We don't think we're going to have a schedule, but we'll have to wait and see how everything pans out. Yeah. Team of the year is very, very soon. We have got yes. a lot of packs saved up for it. I'm really excited for that stream. It's going to be absolutely crazy. Highlights soon will come. be coming to you. Yeah. On YouTube, don't you fear. But until next time, I have been Jack. I've been Robbie, and we've been Backpage Gaming. We will see you in the next one. See you later.